What's up, YouTube? This is Too Raw for TV. So, um, this ain't gonna be a popular video. I know it. I know a lot of people that have subscribed to me. Some of y'all worship this man. And as a basketball player, he was non pareil As an owner, it's been more hit or miss, but, you know, Hopefully, things will get better, but I got to say it. I have to say it. Michael Jordan is in a unique position to have a voice in this situation. You are the only minority owner in the NBA, okay? You're the only minority owner in the NBA. Not only that, you have the respect of your peers. You have the respect of players. And you had respect of those who watch the NBA. And when you say something, people listen. Now, I don't know how he feels about Robert Sarver. Maybe Robert Sarver is a friend of his. I would certainly hope not. But we all read the reports. LeBron James has come out and read the reports read the investigative reports, read the information, and 99% of people will tell you that it's not enough that he got a one-year ban. Okay? Michael, Mr. Jordan, whatever. Many people have accused you of being too apolitical, right? I understand that everybody is into politics like that. But you don't have to be in the politics to be able to just go out and say what is right. You could put a lot of pressure on the NBA by saying, at the very least, the punishment that the NBA has meted out toward Robert Sarver is not enough. And I don't want about coming on here talking about Michael Jordan got to do this and you bring up his six championships. We ain't talking about the goddamn player. This ain't a... Talk, this ain't a, a debate about whether he's the greatest player of all time or he did this and he spoke up about this in the past. I'm not talking about that. We're not talking about something that happened 15 or 20 years ago. We're talking about this situation right now. I really hope that he speaks up. I really do. Um, You know... I really do. That's all I'm going to say, you know. I just hope he says something, man. You don't have to be Malcolm X, like I said. You don't have to, you know, uh, put your, your career on hold, but just speak out about what's right, man. LeBron's already already uh, popped that cherry, <laughs> for lack of a better term. So I just hope some other people come out. And also, after Sam Michael Jordan, where are you, Shaq? Okay? You're a powerful voice in the media. Where's Charles Barkley? Where are you, Draymond Green? You speak about every else, every else, everything else. Where are these people? I'm telling you, man. Look, man. If I was a if I was a person of 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 of, of their stature, um, and their wealth, I wouldn't hesitate saying something. Oh, you just saying that? No, because I don't give a fuck what people think about me. That's always been a trademark in my I don't give a fuck what you think about me. I'm going to talk about, I'm going to say what I feel. As long as it's not, you know, hurting somebody that I care about and shit. But, man, whatever. I don't know. I just hope Jordan says something, man. Tell me what you guys think.